I want a ticket to anywhere Maybe we make a deal Maybe together we can get somewhere Any place is better Starting from zero, got nothing to lose Maybe we'll make something Me, myself, I got nothing to prove What's up you guys? Welcome back to your girl's music journey. Today you guys are gonna be exploring new artists. This one is Grace. Grace Jones. Demolition Man. Song written by Sting off The Police. We have reacted to The Police before. Um, Grace Jones, I don't believe we have reacted to. Jamaican model, singer, songwriter, recording producer, and actress. Damn. A-Side 1981 single. The band Police later released their song of the album on the Ghost in the Machine. Okay, so the uh, song was written by Sting off the police. Okay, let's get straight to it. First time ever reacted to um, Grace Jones. And if you guys want me to do the police version, I will. But let me know down in the comments, and I definitely would do them. But you guys have to let me know. Okay, demolition.
Oh, wow. So she is definitely different. I mean, definitely gave me like a Lady Gaga vibe. I mean, did y'all see the intro? Not only the intro, but the outro. Definitely different. Demolition Man. Supposed to be spooky, scary, I mean, dangerous. Darkness is in this person. People should run and fear this person when they, they're they in the presence of a demolition man. At least that's what I got from it. Like a spooky mystery person, like maybe a whore. Like it seemed like he got to look, fight a lot of demons, darkness. Grace Jones is a Jamaican model, single songwriter, producer, and actress. Ranked 82 in the VH100 Women of Rock and Roll. She was honored to Q Idol Awards. Cross-dressing cross movement in 1980s has been inspired by the artists Annie Lennox, who we just start reacting to, you guys. Um, Lady Gaga, Rihanna, Brazilian Girls. Ooh, I never heard of them. Oh yeah, so she was just different than anybody probably else in the room. Damn, I love different. I'm weird my damn self. <laughs> so Demolition Man is a scary person. Someone that you intimidates. Intimidates. Right? Maybe? Um, Sting, who wrote the song, girlfriend future wife he gave it to grace jones who recorded 1981 the police record the version of the next year when the band agreed they could do it better than jones so why would you give it to jones if you knew you could do a better job with oh gosh the first song recorded off the album which the police worked on the caribbean island the session went well because the song was easy to play at the band was for fam <laughs> the band was familiar with jones version this is one of the few police songs Sting originally played at his solo shows. Mm, it was his set list of his first solo tour in 1985. Sting's on three line whip, a sort of thing they ban, explains. A three line whip expresses matters of seriousness, ultima seriousness. When I wrote the song, I quite finance myself as a natural emergency. I too at time occasionally violated fantasies for unexpected slight to the ego by a masculine pride by patri patriotism. Mmm. So whip it. It's like a sexual tendency maybe? Like domination? Ooh. Now y'all correct me if I'm wrong down the comments. I'm just reading um the song facts. And I definitely would correct myself. Bear bell with me. New artists to the channel. Although we have to react to the police, I would do Demolition Man from there and see how they how they delivered it. Cause this one was definitely interesting because she was just so different. I mean that surprised me so so much. Definitely. Definitely. And I love Lady Gaga, so definitely gave me a different and that's what kind of a vibe she gave me. Um, you guys let me know how you guys feel about Grace Jones. Put more fun facts. Bear with me, you guys. New artist to the channel. So you guys let me know down in the comments. And I definitely will keep rocking her. Uh, see what else she can bring to the table. This one definitely surprised me. So I'm ready for the next one. <laughs> you guys let me know. Be the judges down in the comments. Let's go.